In this two-part overview, we'll show you the highlights of using Provide Feedback in resolving service requests. In Part 1, we showed you the information that's needed to quickly resolve your issue. Now we'll show you how Provide Feedback helps you gather the information required to resolve your issue. Provide Feedback helps you capture the information that's needed. It allows you to describe the issue and provide specific information so we can understand it. Capture multiple screenshots that show us what you were doing in order to reproduce an issue and collect the relevant log files. It also lets service administrators provide consent so we can access the current maintenance snapshot available in the environment. This does not allow us to access your environment. It only allows us to review the migration files or to internally create a test environment of your application. Because application snapshots are stored on a secure server not designed to handle special security controls for some types of data, don't submit health, payment card, or any other sensitive data requiring special protection. A good description shows the product version, service type, application type, user role, the environment, the navigation path, and a description of the issue. Include as many screens as possible to show what led you to this issue. Use the highlight or darken options to focus on errors or to hide sensitive data. After adding a new screenshot, use the description field to explain what you did on the screen. Here's how to include multiple screenshots in a submission. Begin by navigating to the first screen that you want to capture and then select Provide Feedback. Enter a description and then click Add to capture the current screen. Now navigate to the next screen that you want to add to the feedback and then click Add. Explain how the information in the screen is relevant to the feedback and click Add. The captured image count indicates the number of screens you captured and attach to the submission. Repeat this process to add more screens or click Submit. Provide Feedback automatically adds browser, environment, and plugin information to your submission. You can use the back and next buttons to review the screenshots that you added. It's very important that you provide consent to allow us access to the current application snapshot. Only service administrators can grant this consent. By granting consent, you're permitting us to access the current maintenance snapshot to reproduce the issue and test fixes, including the snapshot, in regression test suites for upcoming releases. We don't access or modify your environment and data in any way. The issue will be reproduced in our test system. Without your consent, we can't reproduce the issue. When you've finished entering your feedback, click Submit. You'll see a reference number, which identifies your feedback submission in our system. It's very important that you keep track of the reference number. Without it, we can't find your feedback. Next, go to My Oracle Support to create a service request. Be sure to enter the reference number in response to the question beginning with, before reporting a problem. This way, we know you've provided feedback and can access your details. The reference number allows us to retrieve your submission, which includes the log files from your environment, a description of the issue, screenshots showing actions leading up to the issue, browser and plugin information, and, if consent was provided, the current maintenance snapshot. In order for support to initially assess the severity of the issue, it's important to add as much information as possible to your service request. You need to enter similar information to the request as you did for providing feedback. Continue to stay in touch with us as we work through your issue. Add any new information to the service request and promptly respond to queries from support. In this overview, we showed you the highlights of how to create effective service requests by leveraging the information captured using Provide Feedback. To learn more, visit cloud.oracle.com.